What I've done here is I've put a background down and I want to create the illusion of depth on the surface. So I'm going to put a, a nice thick coat of impasto gel over the top and then I'm going to do some work over the top of that. And what that'll do is it'll create some separation between the layers. The other thing that it'll do, it'll mean that if I make a mistake for some reason on the layers that I put on top, I can wipe them off nice and easily. So I'm going to use this impasto gel or heavy gel gloss. Um, I'm going to use an Atelier product because it's nice and glossy. Some of the other impasto gels are matte and it makes it harder to tell the tonal values later on. You know, a nice big healthy dollop and throw it on and just start spreading it around like that. Try and keep a wet edge so I go across in strips and you'll notice that I'm mixing up my brush strokes. If you want some of this texture to show through later on, then leave plenty of tooth in the surface. If you don't, just soften it off with the tip of your brush. Okay? I'll just keep working across and down, across and down, keeping a wet edge as I go, so you don't end up with any gluggy marks where, the, where they join up. There we go, I've got a nice healthy coat on my canvas. I don't want too much texture so I've softened it off like this. Here and there. And don't worry about it being milky. That'll dry back perfectly clear in a little while and you'll never see that it was there.